Hey guys, so it is 1141. Just got down to Phoenix. Uh, found a campsite over at uh, Boulder's OHV. Uh, free camping. And it's about 30 minutes away from the track. So I'm just going to pitch my tent here and uh, stay the night. Got to be up early around, I don't know, probably 5.30 in the morning uh, to get over there and get some breakfast and make sure everything's set up. Gates open at 7, so it should be fun. Uh, car's doing well. Um, has a lot more power down here. Uh, not at 7,000 feet. We're at like 2,000 feet in Phoenix now, so the car picked up probably 30% power, 30% torque. A lot more fun. Uh, actually has enough power to to do a skid in second. Um, so yeah, so that'll be interesting because I haven't spent much time driving it with this much power, so hopefully I don't snap over steer, but we'll see. Uh, we should get some video footage tomorrow of that. Uh, I did a couple practice uh, practice launches down here and uh, took this twisty road that I have fun on uh, called Bumblebee if you're ever in northern Phoenix. Uh, it's the Bumblebee exit and it's just this short mile and a half section of road that's super fun. Um, just to get a feel for the car down here. Uh, so I did that, so that should be fun. Uh, should help out a little bit tomorrow morning, uh, but we'll see how I do. We're meeting up with Kyle uh, in his NA Miata that he just bought yesterday, actually. So we'll see how he does, but he just got his RPF1s and Nitto Neogens on it, and uh, he got his teen lowering springs on there, too. So he should do uh, pretty well, but we'll see. I'm hoping I can keep up. I'm still on stock suspension, stock brakes, stock tires, wheels, size, everything like that, so... The only thing we have done is the silver top swap. Uh, and then we're also meeting up with Alex in his uh, like 2005 Mini Cooper S supercharged one. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll see who else is out there. Anyway, I'm going to set up the tent. Yeah, so I don't know if any of you guys are into uh, backpacking or uh, camping or anything like that. But if you are, uh, not that I'm biased or anything, I work at REI as well uh, as a bike mechanic. Um, but the Quarter Dome 2, REI Quarter Dome 2, is an awesome backpacking camping tent. Uh, super lightweight. Um, for the money, you can't really beat it. Um, and then uh, I have the Camp Bed 3.5, which is a uh, super rad, uh, more of a car camping, super thick uh, sleeping pad. So it's nice and comfy. Not for backpacking, really, but great for this. Uh, and then I just have a crappy Eureka sleeping bag that I got at the garage sale. So, we're going to set that up. But, uh, got the frunk open on the MR2. And I got my sweet REI staff duffel bag. Putting it to good use. Thanks, REI. But, yeah. Anyway, I'm going to get set up. So I just got to uh, the track here at Arizona Motorsports Park Amp. Um, so just uh, parked up, gonna get registered, and then I gotta run sound. Uh, got here pretty good time at 7:15, so just after uh, opening gates. So should be good. Waiting for Kyle and Alex to show up. Still. So we're about to run sound. At this uh, track, it's next to a golf course, so we have to be under 92 decibels. Uh, so the, the MR2 shouldn't have any issues. The only thing I'd be a little concerned about is if I uh, backfire and shoot some flames at them. But uh, that shouldn't happen if I let off. If I don't let off um, in second or third, that's the only time it really does it. So we should be all right. Kyle 
Miles right in front of us in the Miata. He got this car two days ago. Slapped his teen springs on it and the RPF ones with some Nitto Neo Gens. So we'll see how he does. It's got sway bars, uh, aftermarket strut bar, wheels, tires, and suspension. So it should do pretty damn well out here. Okay, you sound tested before? I have. In this car? Not in this car. Oh, okay. So, same thing, right? Mm -hmm. Just to the cones, hard as you can, the cones are laying down, <coughs> then follow it around, the cones will guide you out of the end. All right. All right, whenever you're ready. Thanks. Thanks. Like usually where I have the upper hand over Kyle. He's yeah. like he
Uh, I got I got going too quick in second, and uh, just uh, had to lock up the brakes. It wasn't turning in, so oh, I gotcha. yeah, locked up, had to reverse to not miss oh, the gate. So got it. Oh, yeah. honestly, 67 isn't bad considering I had to yeah, reverse. Had to go reverse One oh 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 sixty one flat. I'm happy with that. Beat I'm happy with that. Beat your time, but not Kyle. Sixty one oh 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 though. Was it sixty one flat? Nice. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Yeah, that's uh.